Hi, in this video, I will explain what Macaulay's duration is and its calculation using weighted average times to each coupon payment. Macaulay's duration equals the weighted average of the times to each coupon or principal payment made by the bond. The weight applied to each time to payment should be related to the importance of that payment to the value of the bond. The weighted average formula looks like this. Let's take an example. Find the duration of a 6% coupon bond making annual coupon payments if it has 3 years until maturity and a yield to maturity of 6%. What is the duration if the yield to maturity is 10%? The calculation will look like this. Since the bond has 3 years to maturity, column 1 shows 3 time period. Coupon payments are in column 2. Note that last year's payment is 1060 which includes both coupon and principal in column 3 we discount each of these coupon payments by 6% ytm the sum is 1000 which is the bond price this number may not be 1000 all the time in column 4 each number in column 3 is divided by the sum to calculate the weight for example divide 56.60 by 1000 you get 0 0.0566. Please make sure that the sum in column 4 is 1. In column 5, we multiply weight by time. For example, 1 times 0 0.0566 equals 0 0.0566. Finally, the sum of column 5 is 2.8334. Hence, when YTM equals 6%, the duration is 2.8334. Now, the second part of the question, what is the duration if the yield to maturity is 10%? The calculation looks like this. We do the same calculation as described previously. Please note that, unlike the previous table, the column 3 of this table shows the price of the bond, which is 900 point. Finally, in column 5, the sum is 2.8238, which is the bond's duration. Hence, when YTM equals 10%, the duration is 2.8238. In summary, when the yield to maturity increases, the duration decreases. Thanks for watching.